What's up, fellow Earthlings? Today we're going to be talking about Amazon's number one blaster, the AKM 47. Now, you may be wondering why I chose this little rinky dinky, orangish, blackish, and white striped no blaster. <laughs> All right, so let me tell you my reasoning, guys, and keep in mind that this is all my opinion, and you may have a different opinion on these blasters. Now, after using these for several months, shooting them, uh, shooting my kids with them, getting shot with them myself, the number one reason why I chose this blaster, guys, is because it's gravity feed. This is a hopper, which you fill with Orbeez bullets gel blasting bullets. Fill this bad boy up, you flip your blaster upside down and you just screw it in like so, all right? Now it is gravity feeding all of your Orbeez down into the blaster. That's one of my favorite reasons uh, why I chose this blaster, guys. When you turn this blaster on, you can hear it. It's got a really fast fire rate. I really don't know how many bullets or pellets or gel beads this fires per second or per minute or whatever, but I do know that it is the fastest firing blaster I have. On top of that, the barrel is nice and short as you can see, but even though it's short, it is one of the most accurate blasters that Amazon actually sells. So not only is it a very fast and speedy shooting blaster, if that makes sense. And it also is very accurate. This is one of the strongest and most powerful blasters that I own. Out of all of the blasters I bought on Amazon, it's the most powerful. So if you guys go to Amazon, you'll see all of these colorful blasters all on Amazon. They don't really sell any high-end blasters. I think the most expensive blaster on Amazon is about a hundred bucks. Keep in mind that these, this right here is my top choice for Amazon's blasters, right? But there are other gel blasters on the market. If you go to Google and type in gel blasters or high-end gel blasters, they sell a um, carbon-based uh, blaster, which is not plastic, it's carbon, and, uh, and they are super nice. I mean, they, I haven't bought one yet, but stay tuned for one of the next videos. I have one coming in, guys. It's going to be a $600 gel blaster. I'm gonna be buying and doing a review on that gel blaster, uh, but that's besides the point. This right here is made out of plastic, and so are all the other ones on Amazon. You're not gonna find anything super high-end on Amazon, but this is gonna be the best, most efficient, fast shooting and powerful uh, blaster on the market. And what I mean powerful is like, you can definitely feel this thing hit you through your, your shirt, through your pants or whatever. Um, and if you were to go with no shirt, like I do in my short videos, which I'll put a card up here, I'm doing short videos every single day till Mr. Beast notices me and invites me to a challenge. You can see the welts that it makes on my stomach. This is probably good for anybody that's like, I would say eight years old and up, and uh, I wouldn't shoot them too close. But if you guys have, uh, if you have children or you are a, a kid watching this, um, this is a good choice blaster. Uh, now all of your choices are going to be very similar on there. They're going to give you, they're going to give you all plastic blasters. I would choose anything with a gravity feed. Now that is the number one Amazon gel blaster. I don't know what the name of this uh, blaster is. I have the box around here somewhere. If you want to get me that box over there give me one second okay so this gel blaster is called the mp5 mp-5 thank you very much this is the worst gel blaster i have no idea what is going on with it but no matter what size gel beads i create which means like the Orbeez, you know, you put them in the water, they soak up the water and they expand and they get bigger um, the longer you leave them in there. Now, no matter what size gel beads I use in this thing, it doesn't seem to fire at a consistent rate. Now, it sounds like it fires fast. It really looks cool, aesthetically pleasing. It is still made out of plastic. It also is a gravity feed blaster, guys. But this is the worst one that I bought. I couldn't get it to fire more than two gel beads at a time without breaking as it comes out of the barrel, which obviously takes away from the power, the speed, the accuracy, all of that. 
So um, I would not buy this MP5 blaster off of Amazon for the life of me. And I suggest that you don't buy it either. And, that, and that's pretty much all I have to say. Also uh, on the bottom of this thing, they make it very difficult. It has this like switch right here. And if I can get it, see it opens up and you have to plug the battery in and you have to shove the battery back up in there and then close this thing. They just don't make it. They just don't make it as easy as the AKM 47. This thing literally just opens up right here. Like I said, boom, battery goes in there and it's all good. Now they make carbon blasters, all metal blasters, fully automatic. They make snipers with actual like pullback, um, pullback pins and just really, really cool stuff. So stay tuned for the next video I'm gonna do on these blasters. It's gonna be basically the cheapest blaster versus the most expensive blaster. I'll show you the differences between the two in the next video. And I appreciate you guys watching me, Mr. Effie. Peace out, make sure you subscribe and blah, 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 blah.